We left New York Harbor and had a beautiful sail down the New Jersey coast towards the Manasquan Inlet. We found a very quiet anchorage, which was lovely after our week on the Hudson. We arrived here last night at low tide and it's quite shallow. We didn't scrape bottom, but we got down to two feet on our reading, uh, which means we didn't have much space, much wiggle room. Yeah. But somehow there are sailboats in here. <laughs> Must not be full keel, but still. Glimmery Glass Bridge, this is Catsaway approaching southbound over. So you can see it only lifts uh, on an angle, so we have to stay to the very right. And from certain angles, it looks like we just can't make it through. <laughs> oh, we can, we did it yesterday. Glass Catsaway, you have a full lift. Roger that, thank you. You alright, honey? Yeah. This is scary. It's so it's scary. scary. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Uh, no, sir. We're off. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Good job, honey. <laughs> My hand is shaking a little bit. Sorry. <laughs> shaking the camera. <laughs> All right. This is Brielle, New Jersey. Super pretty area. Lots of fishing boats, paddleboarders. There's a paddleboarder coming up there. Also, fun fact: we learned what fascicle bridge means, <laughs> which apparently is a it's a lift bridge that goes up at an angle using counterweights. Uh, but on our charts, it just says fascicle bridge. It doesn't say the name of the bridge. So yesterday, when Greg was calling in. <laughs> He was calling Bascule Bridge. Finally, the bridge operator was like, Are you talking to me, Captain? <laughs> Honey, tell me about your dolphin experience. We just saw like a whole bunch of dolphins. They were just swimming out there. <laughs> I think they're attracted by the fish from the fishermen. But we tried to entice them onto our boat. <laughs> Got the wind in my hair, got the sun to my back, could be going anywhere, where I am now I've lost track. I've been held down by thoughts so black, they like to tell me the things that I lack, but today I hold my head high. I'm gonna bend those thoughts goodbye It's time Oh, the rain may fall But I don't mind at all It may rain, it may rain But don't won't permeate my brain Oh, the whole wide world may be falling apart but there'll be no storm clouds in my heart No, there'll be no storm clouds in my heart The next day we had a glass ocean, and so we ended up motoring to Barnegat Inlet. Uh, we're going nowhere fast. We're heading out of the Barnegat Inlet at about four and a half knots. We're going about six knots through the water. We're losing a knot and a half because of the current. It's not ideal, but there are other considerations we have to make when deciding on what time to leave, like the arrival time and how late we want to sleep in. We've been embarrassed by all these boats flying around. So this is the inlet. <laughs> it's beautiful, but it's like blocked by hundreds of fishing boats. The Coast Guard just cut us off. <laughs> They just go right to the buoys and stop their engines. So we kind of had to navigate around them. It's always an adventure on Cat's Way. We anchored across from Atlantic City in Brigantine and went ashore to provision. 
We enjoyed a lovely evening and enjoyed some spectacular views. What's going on, honey? <sighs> Herky's having urinary tract problems. I noticed he's having trouble peeing, so we went to the store. We're going to try and give him some apple cider vinegar to ease the symptoms a little bit, and then we'll decide tomorrow if I should take him to the vet. He still seems pretty happy, though. So Diana called the vet, and we're on our way to pick up some special medicated food for Herky. Reduces stress and make us be happy. With Herky's bladder sorted, we went to explore Atlantic City using the city dock to park our dinghy. We found the boardwalk, but it feels like a bit of a ghost town. It's pretty though. We spent a few days in Atlantic City waiting out weather before our passage to Cape May. After exploring the boardwalk, Diana took me to a crazy restaurant with fake gorillas. We took advantage of the free city docks to fill up our water, but ended up being a little bit dubious over the quality. We're uploading and listening to country music and eating South Jersey food. South New Jersey food. Mm -hmm. We're leaving Atlantic City now, heading to Cape May. Atlantic City was a strange place. There were lots of closed casinos and Rundown housing, and, and then you also had these houses that looked like they were out of a fairy tale. Yeah, but it kind of looked like a ghost town, like a movie set that no longer got used. It's a little sad. We've seen a, a few of these towns that seem to be closing up shop. We are in Cape May. We had a hectic day today. So we had been watching the weather forecast and today looked like a good day to sail on a beam reach, which is what um, Katsaway does best. But the winds were pretty strong, a little more strong than predicted. And then also it wasn't quite at a beam reach, it was more like a close reach, um, which kind of has the effect of pushing her out to sea. So the winds were predicted to be up to 20 knots, but they ended up getting past 30. We reefed both our sails, uh, but still we weren't going in a good direction, so we ended up motoring the, the last of it. The bed got quite wet. <laughs> Actually, my side of the bed got wet. So the hatch that I thought I fixed, <laughs> I guess, can hold up to rain, but can't hold up to when waves crash across the bow. But it's okay. Nothing got hurt except for my pride. <laughs> <laughs> there was a bit of um, damage inside, uh, a few things got broken, so we lesson learned is to do more, more prep when we're going to be doing a big sale. I wasn't actually expecting it to be as big as it was today. But the good news is that um, now we have a guideline for the conditions that we want to be in. So I think that's kind of at the top, as in the top end of when we would go. Um, the cutoff point would be near there and we have a good idea of what that's like, so that's good. As soon as we entered the um, Cape May Inlet, we were greeted by um, dolphins, so... A whole bunch of dolphins. It was really lovely. Mm-hmm. Um, all in all, uh, a lovely day, even though it was challenging. Yeah, and the cats, one of the cats pooped where they weren't supposed to. <laughs> that was an unpleasant surprise coming back into the boat. But they did really well. We're leaving Cape May. It was a nice little anchorage, pretty calm overnight, and we got to see lots of Coast Guard ships go in and out. We're going to head through a little canal now and head up in the Delaware Bay. Yeah, we're heading towards the Chesapeake Delaware Canal. And it's a beautiful day. We're feeling super relaxed after yesterday. <laughs> we just got confused by a couple of boys. We drew over some really shallow water. But luckily, our, uh, our rudders did exactly what they were they pop up, if they touch, and they do. So yay! Our first run aground. We can knock that one off the list. <laughs> I've had it with making lists. It's enough just to exist. Baby, let yourself be a star.
stop doubting the earth beneath your feet I'm gonna give myself a break Well that haircut took a lot longer than expected <laughs> and it's still very very patchy We're using an uh, inverter and it's not a full sine wave inverter which means it makes a positive negative blocky kind of AC current as opposed to a nice sine wave and the flippers that I have uh, apparently don't work well with that. It's time oh, the rain may fall but pain no mind at all it may rain it may rain but don't let down permeate your brain all the whole We've made it to Chesapeake City, so I can finally finish off my hair. I have lots of strays up there. Um, now that we're connected to shore power, I'm really hoping that's a problem because I don't want to walk around this town with this head. The wind may take us far and wide. We may get swept off by the tide, but I No storm clouds <laughs> in your heart. No, there'll be no storm clouds in my heart. The boat's here and the ice cream shop's there. This is a good dock. We're going to a Halloween party. We only had uh, kitty costumes, so these costumes don't really fit. <laughs> But you get the point. I'm, I'm a, a pirate. I'm a sailor. I'm a badass pirate. I'm a admiral. <laughs> Able sea cat. I'm a pirate. <laughs> We're going to the Chesapeake Inn right now with our new friends. I'm going there. We spent the whole day on the boat. And now it's going to be a movie night. Because <laughs> it's rainy outside. I didn't know you were vlogging. It's been rainy all day. We went to get ice cream, but the ice cream place was closed because... Ridiculous. Because it's rainy. Don't they know people need ice cream, especially when it's rainy? Thanks for watching. If you'd like to come aboard and meet the cats, uh, let us know. We have a live map, link in the description. And if we're in your town, please reach out.